hold on. <laughs> I think he's dangerous. So today is April 1st and I wanted to prank Mr. CJ like I really did. But I didn't I didn't plan for this. So the only thing I was thinking of doing is getting up before him and like startling startling him and like saying like something happened, like an emergency, so he can just get up and, and just be scared and be like, April Fool's. But I felt like that was a little too mean. Like he's only eight. <laughs> So I thought about it, and I'm like, I probably shouldn't do that. But I want to prank him, like, I want to do, like, an innocent prank. So I'm going to think about something today, um, maybe after school when I pick him up. I don't know what to do, but I really do want to do something for April Fool's Day. But um, right now I'm just going to have a little bit of cereal, and then I'm going to drop him off at school. Um, I'm just actually getting my cereal stuff together. Um, today I... I'm most likely going to spend majority of the day cleaning because I haven't really cleaned. Um, my house is starting to look a little disgusting. And I've done like mild cleaning, like just, you know, over, but over like the top of things. And it, I just, you know, it's driving me nuts. But um, I feel a lot better. Um, so I feel like I'm okay to do some heavier cleaning. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do today. I have planned. I didn't do much yesterday of cleaning because I just chilled and, you know, didn't feel like it. But today it has to happen. Um, even if I do just, just like my kitchen and then I still have, I won't go back into work until Tuesday. So excited. <laughs> um, so, I, you know, I could take it. I could do like one thing each day or something like that each morning or whatever. Um, yeah, so we'll see what else I do. I don't really have anything else planned other than housework, boring housework. That's what today holds. Better write this text. Do you guys see this mess that I've created? It's the mess before the clean nails. <laughs> so this is where I'm at. I'm gonna stop and take a break because honestly, like, I think I'm pushing myself a little too much. Um, I actually wanna drink some tea because uh, the cereal in the morning, it made me, I don't know why, it made me nauseous. It could be that I'm just moving too fast and I haven't really moved like that in a long time. But I'm going to drink some green tea, relax. I have some clothes that I need to fold anyways. So I think that so that I still feel productive, I'm going to do that while I sit down and sort it and fold it. And then I'll get back up and finish cleaning my kitchen because I'm like, I'm going to roll, but I'm feeling nauseous. I don't know why. Hopefully this green tea will help. Yeah, green tea. Salud. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Oh it's, oh, it's like the perfect, like, I don't like hot tea. I like just, just warm enough for me to take, like, big sips and not burn my face. Oh, it feels so good going down my esophagus. Well, today's been pretty productive, actually. Um, I am in the car, ready to go to pick up Mr. CJ from school. And then I'm going to head to either Target, Walmart, Kmart. I don't know which store yet. So, um, I got a, I, I wrote down a few things as I was cleaning that I noticed. Oh, I need to refill or get, like, toilet paper. You know, <laughs> like, I'm down to two rolls. So, it's time to get toilet paper. But, um, let me show you guys how beautiful today is compared compared to uh two days ago mm, beautiful clear skies and let's see if i can zoom in here come on there you go 86 degrees 86 degrees that's what i'm talking about um oh i'm trying not to look dark 
Oh, this is not. This is not. Okay, there we go. Um, there was something that I wanted to talk to you guys before I left to to run my errands. Oh, so I don't know what the heck it was. But I think after I had my cereal this morning, I came back home and I just laid down for a little bit. I was watching TV and I think I took a nap for like 30 minutes. And after I got up, it took like about an hour, but I kept feeling so nauseous and just wanting to throw up that I really haven't eaten anything. Around 2 o'clock, it's now 3, I had those brown rice cakes um, that I'd shown you. Um, and that's all I've had. And I'm just, I don't want to live like this ever, period. But I know that, you know, I'll probably feel more comfortable after I have the surgery. But even then, I'm just scared. I'm like, I'm scared to eat. And I don't want to starve myself. But the moment I felt nauseous or why, like, I was just like, nope, I'm not, I'm not doing it. So I just, I drank a lot of water. I've been, I have been staying hydrated. And I actually, this is one of the things I need to buy is more water. But really, I'm just scared of eating, and I hate I hate this feeling. I really do, because that wasn't my goal. Like, starving yourself is never the way to go to lose weight, or to get healthy, or anything. So it's just so annoying that I feel like this, and I was ugh, I hate it. I just needed to vent. I needed to really vent because I hate I hate this feeling of feeling scared to eat anything so I'm gonna try and eat something now um, after I pick up CJ um, maybe some fruit or something um, now that it's been an hour and the rice cake seems to be doing okay in my body <laughs> I've gone I went to the bathroom twice so I've only had cereal and a rice cake and I've gone to the bathroom twice so I don't know what's going on in the insides but I'm I, I felt it and I was really nervous so um, that's where we're at. I ended up putting, well, there's an airplane. <laughs> I ended up putting, um, two loads in between cleaning, um, just to kind of take a break from cleaning and just, I mean, it's easy to do. My laundry is like literally two, two seconds. And then I ended up buying one of those baskets that has wheels on it. So I'm not doing a lot of work, <laughs> which is awesome. Um, so I, I did that. So it's been a productive day, even though I've kind of been a little annoyed with my eating because um, I did take some chicken to thaw out. I take I took it out of the freezer, and I, my goal is to have dinner. I have some veggies, maybe a little bit of rice, maybe no rice. I don't know, depending on how I feel, and some chicken, just some, something light. But that is my goal. I don't want to go and just eat another brown rice cake or just something really, really small. So I'm hoping that I don't feel nauseous again today. Um, I don't know. I don't know what happened. Maybe it was because I took the nap after I ate. I mean, I didn't. it wasn't immediately I ate. As you guys saw, I went to go drop off CJ. And it takes about 30 minutes. But maybe that's what it was. I don't know. Um, maybe I won't do that again and that won't happen ever again. But... <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> You're finishing up your salad? Mm -hmm. yeah. We're at Corner Bakery, guys. I got a half turkey sandwich and a half salad. Doing good. Doing good. Mm -hmm. I'm doing good. My stomach is a little uneasy, but I think I think it's just one of those days. So, but drinking lemon water and Mr. CJ has got one empty bag and one full bag so you're gonna eat those later okay <laughs> how was school today Good. what did you do <laughs> did anyone play any April Fool's jokes on you yes yeah what happened I did an April Fool's joke too. I did it on Sebastian. Um, I said one day if I brought a toy, my mom letting me bring a toy, but like my main way, 
I'm not playing. Uh, I'm not playing with it. I mean, guess what? I uh, remember that. Remember when I said I'm not letting you play with my ring ring and my mom is doing it? I tricked you, Apple. Oh my gosh! I hope they heard you because you spoke so fast. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I speak. <sighs> you speak really soft and really fast. Uh, no, I speak loud and... Cover your mouth. I want to see the food. I know. No, I don't want to see the food in your mouth. Because Nobody wants anyone, to feed the food in your mouth. But can anyone see? Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is too much salad. Yeah, I left about the same amount of salad. Mm -hmm. And I do like the cheese. <laughs> You're so gross. I love you. <laughs> You're so. <laughs> oh, stop. Hi, everybody. It's my mama. Mama, say hi. Hi. Hello. Thank you. Not the beautiful way. <laughs> I'm just standing up. Okay, let me show you. Ow, I just ended up. No, you gotta hold it far away. Oh. Come on. Wait. Hello. You don't want to see my arm? Never mind. Oh, it's okay. The lens is on this side. Hey, right. I don't even know what I'm supposed to say at all. <laughs> Home. It's actually pretty late. Oh my god, I'm itch on my boobas. Uh, it's nine o'clock. I ended up, oh, I ended up um, going to Kmart, and I bought. I just want to show you guys real quick what I ended up getting there. I got some, huh? Uh, first of all, you need to come home. You need to take off your clothes. You don't go directly to technology. Okay, okay. You need to take a shower because you've been sweating all day. This is what we got. Sorry. I bought some more Lipton green tea. And this one is chamomile mint. So I'm excited. And they're for the Keurig. I still have some of the other Tazo ones. Yes, I still have some left. See, I've drank some. Um, but sometimes I just do hot water and I'll drink one of those teas. Oh, and I bought these at Walmart the other day. I don't remember if I showed you guys, but I'm out mason jars to do like different oatmeals, um, like overnight oatmeals. I've seen, you know, I've been, I've been catching up on my recipes. Uh, so yeah, so I'm going to put these there. And then I also got, um, I got some cleaning supplies, you know, good old, this is, for one for the kitchen, one for the bathroom to clean glass, some easy off, some, I'm gonna wash the tub this weekend. Um, okay, so I got this stuff on sale, this is what I wanted to show you guys. These baking sheets, oh, first of all, the color is awesome, it matches my purse. Um, they were $5 at Kmart, and I like these because even though these are cake pans, when I, um, you know, it's just me and my son, and most of the time I only really cook for him, or um, or just me, and he like he doesn't eat that much sometimes. Um, so I hate bringing out that big old cookie sheet or pan that I have to just do maybe like two chicken breasts or two pieces of salmon, you know. So I'm excited because I can use this, you know, for baking and for cooking. So I got those because those are $5, and that was a good deal. And I also got these. Um, I don't know if it's going to match, but my bathroom is pretty colorful, and my mat is the same color as this. So, right? This is a beautiful, like, mandarin orange. Oh, it's so pretty. And they were three fifty. dollars so... Bam! Oh, nope, there you go. I, I couldn't pass on that. So I got that, and I think that's it. Yeah, oh, and I got some um, uh, clothes for my baby niece, Miss Kayla, and for my, I guess, second nephew, that is my niece's baby, um, but I don't have them because I ended up going, so I called my niece, 
And I asked her if she was going to be home. And she said, uh, you know, I told her I have some baby clothes to give you. And she said, oh, I'm going to be at my mom's house, which is my sister's house. And I said, perfect, because I also bought dresses for my niece. So I could just go to her house and we'll all have one big happy time. But I don't record there because my sister is a little camera shy. And I really haven't asked my niece if she cares, but honestly, I, we were just busy with the babies and, you know, I just didn't pick up the camera and I'm just not used to it doing it there because, you know, I know my sister doesn't love the video. Um, but uh, that's why I'm home so late. <laughs> so this time I remembered to end the vlog and I'm just gonna put my stuff away and I'm gonna go Mimi's and that is night night. If you didn't know, that's what most, um, at least Mexicans, I don't know about how many Latinos say that, but we're gonna go Mimi's uh, as soon as I end this vlog and put my stuff away. So have a good night and I will see you guys in my next video. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to follow me on all my social media at I am Lolo and don't forget to subscribe.